Dear readers, welcome to our channel. Is it true? Trump's remarks are like a giant stone thrown into the lake of the automotive industry, causing ripples. He insists on supporting traditional fuel cars, seeing it as a necessary means to maintain the competitiveness of the American automotive industry. In his speech, Trump mentioned the strategic advantage of oil for the United States and expressed concerns about the rise of Chinese electric cars. However, does this viewpoint hold up in the actual evolution of automotive technology? The geopolitical advantage of oil for the United States was indeed significant for a period. However, with the strengthening of environmental awareness and the rise of new energy technologies, the world is gradually entering the era of electrification. To better understand this revolution, let's take a look at one of the representatives of Chinese electric cars, the BYD Qin Plus U8, and explore its unique features of the BYD Qin Plus U8 as a representative plug-in hybrid electric vehicle, not only competes with luxury cars in terms of price but also attracts attention with its extraordinary performance. This is evident not only in its impressive range but also in three standout features, lateral movement, a thousand horsepower, and amphibious capabilities. Firstly, let's look at the U8's lateral movement and pivot turning capability. This is not just a flashy technology but is built on the unique principle of omnidirectional wheels. This design not only makes the U8 agile in narrow spaces but also provides a unique solution to urban traffic congestion. Meanwhile, traditional fuel cars, due to the issues of engine size and complex mechanical systems, struggle to achieve this level of flexibility. The idea of a thousand horsepower for an electric car is no longer a fantasy. The U8's powerful performance is derived from the clever combination of its for independent motors. In comparison, traditional fuel cars face various limitations in power, with lagging engine displacement and combustion efficiency. This not only gives the U8 an advantage in terms of environmental friendliness, but also allows it to catch up with or even surpass traditional cars in driving experience. A thousand horsepower is not just about pursuing the speed limit but is a manifestation of the advantage of providing powerful driving. In actual driving, this powerful power reserve provides the vehicle with higher performance potential, allowing it to cope more easily with high-speed driving or complex road conditions at the U8 as a plug-in hybrid electric car is not limited to land but also has the unique feature of being amphibious. This feature is not just to cater to consumers' pursuit of novelty but is designed based on the technical advantages of electric cars. The U8 can travel in water for 30 minutes, showcasing not only the advantages of electric car battery technology and sealing, but also explaining the limitation of the time spent in water. The design of amphibious capabilities is not a fantasy but a double breakthrough in electric car battery technology and vehicle structure. Compared to traditional fuel cars, the superior battery technology of electric cars allows them to perform well under various extreme conditions. When we see the U8 freely cruising in the water, it makes us wonder whether traditional fuel cars can continue to meet the diverse needs of future travel. The reason electric cars can make such a huge leap in performance lies in their design philosophy. Electric cars are no longer limited to fuel efficiency but also focus on providing top-notch performance. This design philosophy allows electric cars to redefine the performance limits of fuel cars, providing users with a superior driving experience. The design philosophy of electric cars not only stops at technological breakthroughs, but also incorporates a profound insight into the future of travel. Traditional fuel cars, when facing environmental pressure, often need to make compromises in battery life. However, electric cars, through a new design philosophy, have successfully overcome this challenge, providing a more sustainable solution for travel. The rise of electric cars is not just about saving fuel but is gradually outperforming traditional fuel cars in terms of performance. If fuel cars want to achieve the performance level of electric cars, they must abandon traditional engines, essentially becoming electric cars. 
This viewpoint may seem premature at the moment, but it is undeniable that the rise of electric cars has already posed a certain impact on traditional fuel cars in terms of performance. The rise of electric cars is not just a technological revolution, but also a structural upheaval in the automotive industry. Traditional fuel car manufacturers, when facing the competition from electric cars, not only need to catch up with the technological gap, but also need to consider how to complete the transformation in terms of philosophy. This transformation is not achieved overnight, but it is an irreversible trend in the future of the automotive industry. The disadvantages of traditional fuel cars in terms of electric car performance are gradually becoming apparent, and they will face severe challenges in market competition. Especially with the design philosophy of the new generation of electric cars bypassing the issue of battery life and focusing more on performance, the competitive disadvantage of fuel cars in terms of performance becomes more apparent, and the future challenges become more daunting. The future challenges for fuel cars are not only from the impact of electric car technology but also reflect changes in market demand. Consumers' requirements for cars are gradually changing from simple transportation tools to a demand for comprehensive performance. If traditional fuel cars cannot make breakthroughs in performance, it will be challenging for them to stand undefeated in future market competition. I in the battle between electric cars and traditional fuel cars, the BYD Chin Plus U8, as a representative plug in hybrid electric vehicle not only demonstrates the strong capabilities of Chinese electric cars but also leads the development direction of automotive technology. Trump's remarks may reflect a conservative viewpoint, attempting to maintain the past pattern of the automotive industry. However, what we see is that only by daring to challenge tradition can we create the future. The rise of electric cars is a collision of technology and philosophy and the future automotive industry needs us to dare to break the rules and embrace challenges. So, what do you think the future of cars will be? Do you prefer traditional fuel cars or new energy electric cars? Leave your thoughts and opinions, and let's welcome a brand new era of automotive technology together. Thank you for your patient reading, see you next time. Goodbye.